What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to a college coach rebuilds the Atlanta Hawks. Guys, we're in our second full season with the squad now. Obviously, a little recap of things. Uh, we took over at the very end of what is like the real life NBA season. Uh, some nonsense happened where we basically made the play and we pay a bunch of money to this team. It's not going well. Trey Young's telling us. I don't really want to stick around or I, I don't plan on sticking around. So good luck re-signing me. And DeJounte Murray wasn't cutting it anyway. So I'm like, I got to move everybody. Last year, Nikola Tabic and Alex Saar, two rookies that we brought in. Good seasons. Alex Saar won Rookie of the Year. Now, last year, uh, the end of the season kind of fell apart. Uh, I was hoping that we would be... Oh, I really wanted that jump shot to fall. I was really hoping uh, we would at least be like a play-in team, uh, but a much cheaper play-in team than the year before, but we fell apart at the end of the season. Part of that due to injuries, part of that due to just not having a ton of scoring talent on the team. But we had a whole offseason that you guys saw in the last episode, if not go check it out, where we went and we brought in an entire staff now that aren't just a bunch of drug addicts that I found on the streets of Atlanta. Don't worry about it. Um, but we also drafted Dylan Harper, who honestly, we would have taken with like the second pick in the draft. He fell to us and we're hoping that Dylan is going to be like our leading scorer, our main guy on this team for years to come. Here's old Dylan Harper here. He's a 6'6", like, he's kind of a, what do we want to call him? He's a, he's a, he's a ball handling wing, right? Like, he's 6'6", so he could play the two or the three, but he could also play point guard because he's got a lot of ball handling abilities. He's got a lot of shot creating skills. He's got a lot of passing skills. So we're going to be giving Dylan Harper uh, a lot of power very, very early on in his career. Uh, the thing is, you know, 79 overall, which is amazing for a rookie, right? We, we absolutely love that. But is he going to start over CJ McCollum? And here's kind of what I've determined by talking to some of you guys uh, in the comments. And then also some of you just being in the DMs and stuff like that. They're like, I think that you should start CJ to start the year. And if Dylan Harper's just cooking like to start, then hell, throw him in, right? He's ready right away. But kind of make him earn it at least a little bit at first. And I'm like, I'm a little old fashioned. So I'm like, you know what? I'm kind of all for that. So here's what I think we do. I'm going to build out this this rotation and we're going to see kind of where things lie from there. All right. So this is what I came up with. Uh, Topic going to be playing the one looks like he grew his hair out a little bit. Kind of interesting. Don't worry about it. <laughs> but um, yeah, CJ going to be playing the two 22 minutes a game right now. Keeping it pretty simple. Herbo is going to be starting at the three. Hoping Herb can have a better season for us this year. Then we still got Jalen Johnson and Saar uh, rocking it in the front court. Dylan will be the first guy off the bench with Bones, so we're going to have a lot of scoring punch and a lot of athleticism and speed coming off the bench right away. Then we're throwing in a Kongwu, so sliding down the rotation a little bit, but is what it is. And then we have AJ Griffin and Trey Lyles to kind of wrap things up as we see fit. And actually, I'm going to make sure DeAndre Jordan is there as a possible reserve. Want to make sure we have a center that we can pull in at any time but this is what the rotation is going to look like justin edwards we got to be watching him because if he somehow surpasses like aj griffin and aj griffin's got a lot of nice stats but like justin edwards man like a lot of potential here and like the defense is kind of already there and he's he's a lengthy wing that we don't really have on this team right now like herb herb's lengthy and everything but i'd sure like to have another guy like that like edwards out there so we're gonna we're gonna have to pay attention to aj griffin and see if justin edwards doesn't deserve to be moved up as far as other things that I did uh, in between videos right here, uh, I went and set our shot tendencies and everything. So Dylan Harper, he's getting green light, man. It's like, all right, let's see what you can do, young fella. Bones also getting a big green light. Two guys off the bench. So who's going to be scoring for us in the starting lineup? It's going to be mostly CJ and Saar. Topic will be filling in as needed. Uh, this is how the touches look. But we're presuming that Dylan Harper at some point is probably going to surpass CJ McCollum and jump into the starting lineup. So that's the hope. But we're going to make him earn it, at least in this first uh, video for the season here. But that's, that's kind of what the touches look like. Tendencies remain pretty similar to what you guys have seen before. The shot close, I want pretty low. The mid-range, I want pretty low we've got the three-point shot figured out and uh something i did is because we weren't a very good offensive team last year i'm giving more of a green light to our capable shooters to see if we can't make up for some of that natural creation with just spot up three-point shooting right obviously threes are worth more than worth more than two so if we can just increase our amount of threes hopefully we have the personnel to where we should be able to just like make up some offense that way um, but otherwise, nothing else too different. Like we've we've really prioritized like crashing the paint for guys like Sar and uh, Akangwu, things like that, and even even some guys like Jalen Johnson. I just want crashing a bit more, trying to increase the amount of like offensive rebounds we get. So yeah, that's that's kind of what we're looking at in terms of the roster right now. 
We do have some people that want to talk some contract extensions early on in the season. Herb Jones is one of them. Uh, two years, $7 million. Like, if I can just get you to seven, like, outright, I'm I'm more than happy with that. That's awesome. Herb's coming back. Garrison Matthews, I'll give you another one-year minimum, my guy. I will happily bring you back another one-year minimum. Just to come out here and just stroke some, stroke some shots whenever we need him to, I, I love that. Uh, on, on the team. Just a guy that's going to be on the team for a while too. Some consistency, a familiar face. I love that. Uh, profits look good. I've got all the money set up and everything. So we're looking to continue to make more money on this team so that we can eventually pay all these guys. Player mentorship. Uh, again, DeAndre Jordan's going to be educating Alex Saar. Uh, some of the things he's going to be focusing on is like brick wall, box out beast, rebound chaser. Topic is going to be working with TJ McConnell a lot this year, instilling some more dog in him. Justin Edwards is actually going to work with Trey Lyles so that he can be more of a floor spacer, which is going to be important for him for getting in the lineup. And CJ McCollum is going to train Dylan Harper. He's ultimately training his own replacement. CJ McCollum is a good guy. Like he knows that this is the point of his career that he's at. We're, we're all for it. And CJ's all for it. So I'm excited, y'all. I feel like we've got something here. I know that we don't have like a star studded player yet, but we had the most recent rookie of the year. And I truly think that we can turn Dylan Harper into like our go to score. We're really focusing on the offensive end for Dylan Harper, like just in general, because like I said in the last video for what we gave up to go move up and get Dylan, I need him to be the primary score. That's what I need out of him this year. Like he needs to become that guy on the team that's going and getting buckets. Think of him in like a Donovan Mitchell role where like when he came in, obviously he was picked a little bit lower and he was coming off an injury, but you know, he started off on the bench and then he was just hooping so much for Utah that they were like, okay, we just have to play this dude, right? We, we have to put this guy on the court. And that's, that's kind of what I'm making Dylan Harper do a little bit. I want to make him earn it. One thing I wanted to take a look at is the power rankings going into this year. Where did where did they slot us? Well, they slot us at 26. So expectations for us are low. And that's fair. We're a young team, right? We're, we're growing. But I kind of want to see who's on top here. The Celtics usually on top. Uh, still got Porzingis, Tatum, Brown, Derek White. Uh, ooh, Clay Thompson, that's right. He's down there now. And then a lot of young point guards, it looks like. They're a little bit... Uh, unsure of what they're doing there. Dame is here with Andre Jackson, Giannis, uh, Bruce Brown coming off the bench with Mo Wagner. Jordan Hawkins is an interesting player to play with them. I like that. Who does Memphis got? They got Ja, Bain, uh, Salon. He's the French guy, right? Yeah, he's a French guy coming in the league this year. A lot of those. Gigi Jackson's getting his burn. Jaron Jackson. Awesome, awesome, awesome. They picked up Brooke Lopez too. Okay, C is obviously always really good. The Spurs are number five already. So they the Spurs struggled uh, last year after we traded them to Jonte Murray, which was kind of odd, but that, you know what? It paid off because now they have Cooper Flag and Victor Wimbanyama on one team with guys like Devin Vassell still and Dejounte Murray. They still have a lot of this core off the bench with like Jovic is even here. They picked up Trey Johnson this year. So like this, this team's going to be a problem for years to come. I'm glad these two are in a different conference. Then we just have like the all youth team here in the Rockets and Ahmed Thompson, Jalen Green, Jabari Smith Jr., uh, Kling and Tari Eason, Whitmore, Risa Shea, and then you get to Westbrook, who is uh, old at this point. He's 36, but man, young, young team. So that's kind of where everything's looking. So expectations, not looking great this year. Um, people aren't expecting us to be there, but I'm hoping that with a better staff and just a more balanced roster, I know that we don't have a ton of high overalls, but a little more balance all the way up and down, we can we can amount to a better season. One thing we'll be sure to do this year is we are going to make sure that we are buying still. Like, I want people to know that we're trying to take in talent right away. Maybe it's at the power forward. Maybe it's at the small forward. Maybe something like that. We're going to be watching Herb and Jalen Johnson the whole time to see who's available. But, I mean, just looking around the league right now, like Sabonis, not exactly what we need on our team. We've got our center. P.J. Washington doesn't interest us. Neither do any of these guys. And it's early in the year, right? We're most likely not going to see some R.J. Barrett still available like I just I don't know if he's the right piece to put on this team but let us know Devin Vassell's still out there but we have our two now right we just we don't need him Bradley Beal's out there I'm not seeing anybody Jordan Poole he's he's down he's down right now man he just is not something I'm all that interested in at least for the time being Desmond Bain still no so we'll, we'll pay attention see if any stars become available throughout the year because we've we've got some assets to move if we really want to. We've got a couple first round picks here um, and down the line. So if we need to, we can throw those in. We have a treasure chest full of second round picks if you want to call that a treasure chest. But 
You know what? Without further ado, I don't think I want to play the Bulls team because I think we played them last year and they look rough this year. I'm willing to bet that we can beat this team. They have the number one overall pick, uh, Floyd Badunga, who it just kind of seems like they maybe messed up this pick a little bit, but his potential is high, so maybe maybe he gets there. I don't know if he was first overall pick worthy, but let's simulate through. Yeah, okay, we got a dub in the first game, and how did how did we do here? Uh, Bones and Dylan Harper led us in scoring off the bench. That's... That, that's telling right there. That's telling. We got to watch these turnovers too, man. Turnovers were such a big thing for us last year. We got to minimize those. And it looks like they were still somewhat high this year, especially in our primary ball handlers. Maybe not the secondary guys, but man, Bones was on one. Dylan Harper looked great. How did Saar do? 12 and 11, 50%. I love that three blocks. CJ just was out there getting some buckets. I love it. I absolutely love it. But I want to play this Dallas team now. Luca, Kyrie, they got Stefan Castle, who just won a national championship. Congratulations to him. Looks like he's playing the three now in his second season. Not much of a shooter, but a good defender and a good playmaker. Yeah, that's what I remember seeing out of Castle. Good athlete, obviously, as well. They got Saric to kind of space the floor as needed. They got their twin towers here. They got shooters off the bench and wings off the bench and green. Grayson Allen, Craig Porter, Delano Banton. I love me some Delano Banton, man, in real life. Those of you that have been watching the channel know that. But we're keeping with a similar game plan to last year, man. Like, a lot of the same plays are coming back. So without further ado, let's, let's, let's get into this game. Welcome, everybody. Thanks for joining us for NBA action on 2K Sports. And tonight, our matchup, we'll see the Atlanta Hawks going up against the Dallas Mavericks. I'm Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony, Hall of Famer Doris Burke, and another Hall of Famer, David Aldridge, from the sidelines. Here's a look at the schedule now for Dallas. On Monday, they'll be tipping off a homestand, starting with the Memphis Grizzlies. Then on Wednesday... They'll begin a road trip starting in Utah up against the Jams. And Kevin, I think you have to look at this as an opportunity to take a step forward. Sometimes tough road trips can bring the best out of a team and bring you closer together. Now, we'll look at Dallas's starting lineup. The star backcourt of Doncic and Irving are out there. Charge is out there with Cassell. And it's Lively in at the five. And for the Hawks, they've got Jones, also Johnson out there. And it's Czar in at the five down low. It is still early in the season, Greg. We, we like All righty. Damn, Sar, you're just getting out for the jump now. You aren't stretched and ready to go. I don't love that whatsoever. <laughs> All righty. Well, we going to get into this thing, man. I'm excited. I'm excited. It's a new year, new possibilities. I know we didn't go out and get some big free agent or anything like that, but this is a realistic rebuild, y'all. Like, nobody's necessarily going to want to come to Atlanta right away like we gotta we gotta build this thing out ourselves like traditionally that just hasn't been how it goes oh give me this though for turbo herbo oh but sar he's the rookie of the year who who says we don't got a star player we have alex sar he's the best player on the team oh man but yeah no i know we didn't go out and make some big addition or whatever but we're building it from within and i truly believe that that's the right way to do things give me this basketball give me that basketball too alex sar oh i wanted another one oh i i really wanted that basketball i see jalen johnson running good outlet pass go jump attack attack oh we can't get him Ooh, okay kick out kick out let's let's reset it up reset it up reset it up here we go here we go where are we going here i want sar here and cj's gonna come around and go get him a bucket come on cj that's a three ball see we're rolling now. We've had a year with this group, bringing back the same first five. There's some chemistry now. Um, but yeah, no, we're trying to build things the right way. Think of like the OKC Thunder, right? Like they, they really have built things their way, bringing in their own guys, developing them, taking a longer term approach. Like this is how you build like loyalty and a fan base too. Like it's just, you, you want to see the same guys every year and you want to see them have success. Find CJ, find CJ, find CJ. Oh, jump, attack, attack, Jalen, attack. Oh, I need you to be able to finish that. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll be looking for upgrades, though, throughout the year. Like, if somebody becomes available that just makes sense, like, we, we'll make the move for it, man. I'm not afraid to pull the trigger. But for the time being, I like the squad that we have. I want to see Dylan develop. And we just we just want to, we want to build it in-house. 
that just seems more ideal to me. Like Topic, like Topic, like look at him. He might not have made that shot last year, but he's a second year player now. He's bigger, stronger, faster, and he probably knows more English words. All right, now we're thinking more about this game. How do we stop Kyrie Irving and Luka? Uh, part of it is just get actually close to them. Give me that basketball. That's Sar. Let's go. Let's go. Bounce pass out there. We attack with Jalen. Go all the way, Jalen. Why can't Jalen finish? He's our best player on the team. I need more out of you, Jalen. I, I I hyped you up a lot going into this series. Like, I was kind of hoping we'd be able to develop you more. Um, I did, like, go into his, like... Uh, what, what do you want to call it? His developmental settings and everything. And I'm trying to put a higher emphasis on certain things. But um, well, we're, we're cool with him shooting. But, yeah, so I'm trying to get Jalen Johnson a little more uh, offensive capabilities going forward. We're, we're attacking this again all the way, Topic. Thank you. Is Topic going to be more of a scorer for us this year? At least on the attacking end, right? I feel like that's a good goal for him to start this year. Because uh, three-point shot still isn't, like, good. That's all right. Like, I don't expect guys to be, like, elite with that stuff until their, their second season, like, the end of their second season. I tell everyone, I'm like, I don't judge a rookie's efficiency until, like, towards the end of their second season. I'll start to watch and be like, okay, have you have you started to learn, right? Have you, Is Derek Lively taking that shot? No. I don't know why, but he is. Oh, we're attacking still. We're attacking still. Toe bitch! Ugh! Get up or get out the way! I love it. Thank you, Topic. Is Topic our guy? Is he our best player? Oh my god. I would have never thought. <laughs> oh goodness. I'm in help because Derek Lively thinks he's a spacer. I don't know what they're trying to do here. Oh, that's not how we want to guard him. We'll fix that. We'll fix that at the next timeout. I uh, don't want to go under on the shooter there. Not exactly what I had in mind. Let's let's try and ride a hot hand here. And by that, I mean I want to get the ball to CJ. And we're going to have him come around here and attack this way. All the way, dump it off to Sar. Go up. Damn, that's a good, that's a good counter to Derek Lively. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, no. That's, that ain't it. Uh, Sar, you got to drop again, my guy. You got to drop with this handoff action here. That's fine. Derek Lively can come this way. We're cool. We're cool. Take that shot. Oh, I wanted it. Oh, I wanted it. Time out. Time out. Let's make some adjustments. Let's make some adjustments. Alrighty, first things first, let's get these dudes off the court. Let's get Bones and let's get Dylan Harper and let's get our offense going. Jalen Johnson. Um, you know, we're also going to get Sar off the court for a Kong Wu. We don't want too many of those guys in. But let's keep Jalen Johnson in and let's keep Turbo Herbo in right now. And then let's go to make some actual adjustments on guys. Surprise, surprise, we want to smother and be tight on Luka Doncic at all times. On ball screen, got to go over. Is it even worth just, like, trying to ice him? I think it is, and I'll try to be a help defender on that. Let's make guys like Dario Saric beat us uh, before anyone else. And we're going to say the exact same thing to um, uh, Kyrie here. I think we just have to. Um, it's not like they'll be leaving Luca or Kyrie's guy to come do that ice or help anyway. Stefan Castle um, on ball. We can actually gap him. Let's make him be a shooter. That's one of the guys that we can help off of for things. So off ball, uh, we're going to be... We're gonna be a gap as well, and then Saric and Lively. Uh, same thing. Let's be let's be gap gap here. All right, that's what I'm thinking for now, at least, of how to deal with their first five. All right, y'all. First time seeing Dylan Harper in action. We're gonna let him be a bit of a ball handler at times. And you know what? I feel like I can attack Kyrie because I'm bigger and stronger than him. I'm bigger and I'm stronger than him. Dylan Harper's the best player on the team. <laughs> <laughs> oh no oh man y'all we got a star don't even worry about it y'all y'all didn't think we had a star on the team did you we got we got us a dylan harper man uh what are we doing here stefan castle like no nah, we're we're living that get going go do it yourself then kid go do it yourself then kid crossover oh yep that's fine. charge oh why did he pose like that oh that was kind of sexy they're really hating on my guy Harper, man. It's his second game in the NBA, and y'all calling the bullshit on him this early? Not here for it, man. Not here for it. Give me that basketball. That's mine. Uh, he's got good perimeter defense, too. Go help. Go help. We'll, we'll steal that as well. Somebody help here. Bones, decent defense, but he's too tall. Um, can I have Harper actually bring the ball up the court? And what I want to do then is run floppy action for Bones. Bones loves floppy action. So this is an opportunity. Ooh, I, I got him on my back, though. I got him on my back. Bones, give it to me, Bones. Give it to me, Bones. Like, oh, man. Bone, getting Bones was amazing. Like, 
we he he said he wanted shots. I'm giving him shots, right? I see you, Grayson Allen, trying to come over every screen possible. Like, God damn, where is Luca going now? I gotta watch Luca here. Daniel Gafford's running around like a madman. Um, someone help. We're fine here. We're fine here. I don't know anything about this McNeely dude that's on the court, but he's got a swaggy headband. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go. Uh, we can attack Grayson Allen, right? No, nope, not with this kind of post presence. Let's go here. Let's get it out to Harper. Let's see how good Luca's defense really is. Let's see how good it is. Let's go with the fade. We're going to go at this boy, McNeely, all the way. I'm too strong. I'm too talented. Dylan Harper out of Rutgers. Ron Harper, stand up. Give me this basketball. Ooh, I wanted it. I wanted it. Come on. Come on. Ooh, help, 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 help. Give me that. Let's go. Let's go. Dylan Harper, all the way. Dump it off to a Kongwu. That's a bucket. We're making plays. That's what I'm talking about, y'all. Good, good end of the quarter. Good end of the quarter. We clap those up. Clap those up. Young fellas out there producing for us. Out here making plays, getting buckets. We got us. We got us a good one in Dylan Harper, y'all. All right. On to the second quarter. Little side note for those of you that actually care. Um, I'll, I'll actually be traveling at the time of this video dropping. Um, I've got some real life basketball stuff that I have to do. Um, for those of you that don't know, I run a business, a sports analytics business for primarily college basketball teams but some pro teams in other countries as well this is helping out a college team as they navigate like the transfer portal i'm going to be teaching them like how to incorporate a certain offense or whatever so just know that that's going on in the background that your boy is still doing the real life coaching a little bit here and there but can i set a screen here for sar we want our dynamic duo doing dynamic duo things oh alex sar oh why is that why does that just look so clean it just it just looks right seeing a Serbian guy lob it up to a French dude. Like don't don't think about that in like World War II logic at all, but just just take it for what it is. I'm standing up now because it hurts to sit. And Daniel Gafford's bringing the ball up the court. There's a lot of strange things going on in this basketball game. Can I just can I just take this basketball please? Dive. Dive, Sar. Oh, so close, but I love the hustle. Um, he also has a headband on now. That's a new development as well. Uh, some of the young guys taking on some new style going into the second season. You got to be confident if you wear a headband in a basketball game. Leave me a comment if when you hoop, you would hoop in a headband. Like, I'm just, I'm just curious. Give me that basketball. Ah, I got dunked on. I thought he was going to pass it or shoot it there. I shouldn't have gambled. That's not some, I, that's something I'd yell at somebody for in real life. But can I get... AJ Griffin on this fist action here. I want to go here. I want to go here. Mostly just because, yeah, I didn't think Grayson Allen could help. Let's get a shot up for Trey Lyles. He's got an 86 three-pointer. That's why we brought him in, man. Just a nice veteran that's going to space the floor for us. Grab a couple rebounds. A little bit of size. Give me that basketball. Oh, Sar. How are you supposed to win Defensive Player of the Year this year if you if you aren't doing stuff like that? All right, now we're going to run Atlanta 25 fist here. Coming off for Topic, we go all the way around, hit Sar. That's a man's jam. I low-key wanted to stomp my foot there in real life just because that's what I would have done on the court in real life. I saw something like that. But, you know, we got to keep it cool. We got to keep it cool. We're not too excited. That's a bad shot. Give me this rebound right here. Oh, that's a man's rebound. Let's go. Let's go. I see Lyles. Can I get another three? Ooh, pump fake. Ooh, can I back him down? Can I back him down? No, but I see Sar. I see Sar cutting. We got smart players on the court, y'all. We're, we're we're a better team this year. We've got some offense now. Like we've got enough offensive weapons all around where we're gonna be able to make this work. Come here. Give me that basket. <gasps> no. Oh, get off the ground. Why do they keep posing like that? Sar, I'm with you, dog. What the hell? Oh, shake it off, Kyrie. You're good. Time for some good old-fashioned floppy, y'all. Time to get CJ his touch. Come here, CJ. Come here, CJ. Get your bucket, CJ. Get your... Oh, CJ, you're falling off. Oh, no. Last year, CJ would have made that shot. Give me that. That's all mine. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, CJ. Come on. I see AJ Griffin. I see Trey Lyles over there. We'll take a long two. That's fine by me. We're just going and getting buckets, man. We can run in transition. We got dudes that can handle the rock this year. This is glorious. I don't know how I feel about Kyrie Irving being guarded by CJ McCollum because things like that can happen, though. Uh, we got to start putting them away now because we've got a lot of momentum and they just keep like hitting little threes and stuff here and there. And I'm sick of that happening personally. So I'm going to go all the way with Topic. 
We'll take a foul. That's fine. Fall off the rim. There we go. 2K. Remember, we sag off. Coach, why do I have two centers in? I definitely made sure that that wasn't ever the case in the rotation. But you know what? Is what it is, I guess. Uh, we're going to come set this screen. This is where I got to come over and help. Good defense. Damn. That's just Luka doing Luka things. How about Luka in real life, man? Him and Kyrie. Mavericks just look good since that deadline, man. Like, them adding P.J. Washington and guys like that. Like, I don't know. I just, I love it. Oh, why did, he was going to cut and then he stopped cutting. But that's all right. We can, we can guard up. We can guard up. Give me that. Oh, my God. Dylan, why? Why did you throw him? Oh, it's it's because it's Grayson Allen. You don't like Grayson Allen? That's fine. A lot of people don't. I just realized, too, Grayson Allen's wearing number eight. That was uh, Josh Green's number. Did he, like, kick Josh Green in the balls and take his number? Or, like, what the what the hell happened there? Like, he really just took his number from him. But whatever. Can we just go right at him? Can I just go right at him? Oh, oh I tried to pass it off to a Kongwu. I tried to give it to a Kongwu. Bones. Let's go. Get busy, Bones. Get busy, Bones. Don't don't block me. Like, why do y'all do that? That's a steal. That's my basketball. Take that shot. I hope you... Who? On who? Dylan. Oh, that's three on Dylan, man. That he, Was he not straight up? Let's see. Dylan Harper's here. He goes... Where exactly is the foul on Dylan Harper? Like, he pushes off on me. Like, I have right to the contact here, or whatever. He goes up into me, into my chin. Come on, 2K. Come on, 2K. You know what? We're going to make Dylan play through it, man. I'm going to make him play through it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to operate here. I'm going to get by him because I can. I want to see him dance a little bit. I want to see him dance a little bit. Come here, Stefan. Let me see. Let me see what I got. Let me see what I got. Spin move. He's the better player. He's the better player. This is this is our guy right here. We have got a shot creator. You pissed him off. Now he's going to go get some buckets. And eventually, Bones, you'll get to go back to being just the bench scorer on this team. Take that basketball. Akongwu, take that basketball. He's too big. Somebody else has to guard him. Uh, we can't have Bones Highland, like, guarding him <laughs> at any point in this game. Let's go again, Dylan Harper. Come on. Why does it take the bar away from me? Come on, back door for Harper. There we go. Get that shot up. That's green, 2K. I, I, you guys tell me. Could I have timed that any better? Like, that's a... It, it got up on the rim, so I can clearly time it perfectly. Like, so, y'all y'all help me out. We're supposed to, we're supposed to ice that, Jalen. Come on, Jalen. Where are we going? Where are we going? Can I attack here? Can I attack here? Ooh, step back. Hit Jalen Johnson. Go up. Good pass by me. Good good, good, good vision. I saw Jalen open. I was going to take the shot. Made the pass first. Always been a pass first guy. Can I get Topich or Topich back in? One of the two. Give me that basketball. Oh, I couldn't get to him. Um, Luca is absolutely torching us right now. And I don't like it. Let me just get a general pick and roll. You guys always want to pick and roll on the wrong side. There we go. We blow by all the way. Dylan Harper, get up. Get out the way. That's what I'm talking about. We, we got a bucket getter in Harper, y'all. Like, y'all let me know. Uh, by the time you guys see this and everything, like, does Harper just need to start, like, right away? Fuck off, Luca. Like, literally. Just, like, get out of here, dog. Um, no two-for-one opportunity here. It's just not enough time. It's fine. It's fine. So here's, here's what I'm going to do. We're going to get the ball to Bones, and we're going to go up to Herb here. I want to get a post touch, and let's... Violation. Where did I step out of bounds? Oh, no. And they're putting Kyrie in to try and close us, man. Come on now. Come on now. That ain't it. Did I step out of bounds? I don't think so. But, uh, Bones, you got to stop Luca for me, my guy. You really got to get a stop on this, on this white boy right here. Come on. Stop this Caucasian right here. Stop this Stop this mean-ass white boy. Come on. There we go. There we go. All right. Going into half and everything. Um, Got to make some adjustments so that uh, Topic is always on Luka Doncic. That's just what needs to happen. If Luka's in, Topic is in. That's just what's going to have to happen because uh, we don't have the personnel otherwise. But otherwise, we, we got to get back to making some three-pointers, I think. like We, we talked about making more three-pointers. And we need to start taking more. So we'll make those adjustments. We'll see you after the half. This is my small plug to tell you guys to please subscribe and leave a comment. The comments are my favorite part. And we're almost to 1,000 subs. And when I get to 1,000 subs, it means I get more time to make more videos. Because I can start making money off them. That's transparency right there. Back to the video. Bye. All right. Let's start this half off with a little three-pointer right here. I would like to get the 35 elbow play going this time. Is he going to be?
beat him around. No, he's not. We're going to get the ball here. Going to come up. And then we're going to go this way. Get the handoff here. And we attack from here. Go all the way, CJ. Find Herbo. Couldn't get the three-point shot going. Take it, Herbo. Come on, give me a three-pointer. Oh, that play just, like, something with the timing of it just, like, doesn't quite work. I don't know what it is because, like, I know what that play is in real life. And I know how the timing of it's supposed to work. But, like, I don't know, something about 2K, the guys just run too slow when they're going through their play motion and stuff. And it just, it doesn't work. So, it's it's whatever. We'll, we'll let him have that shot. Okay. Maybe we can't let him have that shot. <laughs> um, CJ, being as old as he is, is a little bit of a defensive liability at this point. Um, but that doesn't mean I can't go take some offensive shots with him. Let's go, CJ. Get your bucket. Nope. Not at all. Okay, back to playing defense it is. Uh, Topich, I need you to shut that boy down. We're fine with you taking threes. I am so fine with that. Jalen, run with me. Run with me, Jalen. Run with me, Jalen. Couldn't get him. Couldn't get him. Kick it back out. Kick it back out. Let's run this. Let's run this. Let's just get a pick and roll. Roll, 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 roll. We got him beat. We got him beat. Jam! Oh! Oh, no! Oh, why did he, like, grab my chest like we were having an intimate moment there? Ooh, that was kind of sultry. All right, y'all, down one. Time to time to get a play going. Let's get... We're just going to go back to Floppy, man. Like, we're getting open looks from Floppy. So, like, I'd like to think that we can get something going here. Ooh, cross him, cross him. Go back out, go back out. Oh, take the shot. I need it. I needed that. Come on. Just go, just go. I see AJ Griffin. God damn it. These passes in 2K, man, makes me so mad. <laughs> like, why why can't they catch and why can't they pass? Like when they jump. Why is that a thing? Help help me understand. Oh, Lord have mercy. Come on now. We're like, you're supposed to sag off of Castle. Sag off. Go under. That's fine. We're living with this all day. Give me that board. Let's go. I see Griffin running with us. I'll just go myself, I guess. There we go, CJ. Helping us on the offensive end. That's what you're supposed to do for us, dog. Still got to go get us some buckets. I don't think we're getting 24 points a game out of CJ this year with the age and talent that he has at this point. But, oh, damn. Luka's just hitting every shot. And that's probably how teams feel uh, guarding him in real life. But, okay. I need, to, I need to figure out a game plan of how to stop this. First things first, let's make our subs. Uh, let's get Dylan and Bones back in. Um, can I get Herbo back in? I like Trey Lyles in with this group. And then let's just get a Kong Wu in. Yeah. Are we just going bench squad with Herb? Yeah. How's Well, how's Jalen doing? 84. Um, looking at where rotation is and everything right now. Okay, no, we're going to run with Jalen a little bit longer. Um, okay, yeah, that's what we're going to do. Uh, Luca, how are we going to hard the... Uh, can we do a hard hedge? on him i think that's probably for the best to try and help with some of those pick and rolls or whatever i don't need to double team him at all i just i really need us to actually like ice him on the on ball screen force direction no i don't think so um but we want to make sure he's guarded by Topic at all times like Topic is a really good defender he's got the size to somewhat compete with him so i think that's what we have to do otherwise like the rest of these guys like we told him to gap right yeah, like on ball screen, um, go go under on him. I think I think that's gonna have to be what it is. But we gotta get some offense going. So Bones and Dylan, uh, this is your guys' time to shine right here. Let's let's get a play going for um, for Bones like right away here. Can I get uh, this one here? Let's go here. I'm coming out. I need to see Johnson curling around and then attack all the way. Come on, Johnson. Damn. We just get blocked all the time, but we'll make our own offense with Dylan Harper. Ugh. And one. J just had to make something out of nothing, man. The plays aren't working today. They're sniffing them out. And it's mostly, it's just our guys, like, are so slow. Once they catch the ball, they don't, like, keep their momentum. And it's so dumb. Ooh, go back up. Go back up, a Kong. Kong, what's the point of you being so big and damn strong if you're not going to make plays for me? Give me that. Oh, you punched him in the nipple. Where do you guys think Dallas is going to finish in real life, though? Like, it's kind of like what I was saying before. Like, my God. Like, they just... They've just been playing so well since they added those new pieces. It makes a ton of basketball sense why those pieces have been so good. But... 
Like, where do we think they can actually go? Can I split this? Can I split this? Can I split this? And then kick it back out to Johnson, to Dylan, and we attack again. Dump it off to a Kongwu. Pick it up, a Kongwu. Oh, come on, dog. I need you to have hands. This is why you're not starting over Sar, even though you're like the highest overall on our team. Oh, that's so annoying. All right, we got to help. Don't make that too. Stop it. Oh, y'all piss me off. Y'all piss me off. We're supposed to be better this year, guys. We're supposed to be better. All right, we'll, we'll just make a Kongwu do what he does best then. Go up and get Ali Oops. There we go. Dylan Harper doing it all, man. He's just... Uh, Dylan Harper's got to close this game 100%. We got to have him in with the starters, which means... I probably got to sit him to start the fourth quarter. Uh, they're calling a timeout, interestingly enough. That's fine. Let me make my subs. Bones and Harper are good. That's fine. They can finish it off. Herb still has a shit ton of energy because he always has a shit ton of energy. We're going to go add a little bit more floor spacing because Jalen Johnson isn't helping us out much right now. And let's go back to Sar just to make sure that he's got enough energy by the end of the fourth quarter. We'll sub him out at the beginning of the fourth so that he can close the game then. So let's go with that, especially because Ka Kongwu is just pissing me off right now, man. Like, I, I like Kongwu. I really do. Just got to play better this game. Just one of them days, man. Just one of them days. We can sag off of Gafford so I can help. I can help at all times. We're good. If the pick and roll comes with Kyrie, I'm helping with Trey Lyles because he's guarding Stefan Castle. Um, Topic is supposed to be in right now. All right, we're here. We're here. Good, 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 good. Yep, that's fine. We're living with that. That's exactly what we wanted. But he hit the three anyway, man. That was perfect defense. Perfect. Nobody's in the paint. Nobody's in the paint. Attack. Attack, Dylan. Oh, come on. You're telling me I couldn't finish that? Like, that's, that's such an easy finish. It's just a right-handed layup. I know he's left-handed, but damn. Oh, come on. We're sagging off with Lyles again. Sagging off with Lyles again. I'm here. I'm here. Turbo Herbo. Where did he come from? Well, I didn't like that one bit. Not one bit. Pick and fade. Pick and fade. All the way, Bones. Ooh, spin move? Nope. Wasn't there at all. Attack with Sar. Nope. That's not there either. Where is Dylan? Get it out to Dylan, man. All right, ISO. ISO, let me cook. Let me cook. Let me cook Kyrie. Let me cook Kyrie. That's a good shot. That's not a bad shot, but I thought he was going to go all the way to the hoop. Oh, y'all make me so sad, and that makes me even more sad. Where's Topic? He's supposed to be in the game right now. Oh, coach, why don't you listen when I make suggestions, man? Why don't you listen? We're just going to, we're just going here. We got everybody on one side of the floor. That's exactly how I like it, coach. An attack all the way. Dylan, get up. Okay. Dylan's our whole team. That's what we've learned today. He's the best player. He's the only good player. <laughs> That's not true. But come on, come on. Give us, yeah, that was a really bad shot. That gives us another possession. That gives us another chance for Dylan Harper to go do something stupid. Oh, I just needed you to make the layup. Oh, I did something stupid now. That was a horrible shot attempt. Um, okay. Harper will come out to start the fourth. Uh, we'll get top pitch back in and everything. We'll, we'll close the game with who's ever hot at the point guard. Or if we just need the defense, it'll be top pitch. But... I don't know. This is this is annoying. We got to stop those two. <laughs> Again, this is what every person playing the Mavericks says. How do you stop those two guys? Well, one way to stop them is to not have them in the game right now and me just taking the basketball from Craig Porter Jr., right? Give me that basketball. Come here. Come here, little shit. Come here. Come here. We're here. Good defense, AJ. He's just really going to, like, spray me in my mouth like that? I don't really got to pay for shit like that, but whatever. <laughs> Come on. We got the 10-20 pick and roll. 10-20 pick and roll. I'm ass. I'm bad at the game. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Stop them. Stop them. Why are we leaving Kyrie Irving so open? Like, is there something I'm not understanding? Like, is there something that I haven't made clear about how... Why are both centers in the game? I thought we had a balanced staff this year. Did they find crack left over from the old staff? Like, help help me understand. There we go. Go up. There we go. Good basketball top pitch. See how he just waited in the middle of the floor? Caused two guys to guard him there? That's smart basketball. Top pitch has had a good game, man. He might be our best player. <laughs> um, Sar is not supposed to be in the game right now, and it's really, it's really messing with me. CJ, can you go get a bucket? Can you go get a bucket, CJ? Can I get a foul, please? Like, he was all over me. If we call in some of those fouls on Harper earlier... I got to get a foul there, right? Like, he wasn't even straight up. 
That's just, that's just incorrect. That is incorrect by you guys. Come here. That's fine. Get the rebound. No. No. Not Grayson Allen. No. I'm this close to calling a timeout. But for now, we're just going to go Sar, pick and fade. And I can attack Sarich. We're going to get a nice little easy jam from my white friend, Nikola Topic. Speaking of white people, I got my favorite comment on a video the other day where I said something about Matas Buzelis being white and him going to Utah. And I was like, oh, they added another lengthy white. And I had someone in the comments being like, how dare you be so racist? And I was like, Oh my gosh, this is my favorite comment ever. I love when people are so dumb like that. I just really do. I don't know why it makes me laugh so much, but thank you to whoever left that comment. It genuinely made... Oh, I was going to say it made my night. Oh, no. Whatever, but yeah, go find it. It was on like my latest draft video. So it's, it's so funny. He actually left two comments, but we got a... That's an illegal screen. Oh... If they get a bucket here, I need a timeout. If they get a bucket here, I need a timeout. If they get a bucket here, I need a timeout. I need a timeout. Uh, <laughs> you guys make me so upset. Why aren't we guarding Kyrie Irving? Okay. Okay. Topic is fine. Dylan Harper's got to get back in the game now. Why is Jalen Johnson here? No, that's Herb Jones. Um, we're going to go... We got to go Jalen now, and then we got to go Akongwu here because Sar's tired now. Great fucking job. Um, Luca's gonna be back in the game soon, right? So we gotta keep Topic in the game. Okay, we got our boys in. Uh, time to see, time to see Dylan Harper play some big boy basketball, man. Second game of his NBA career. We're going right away. Going right away. Ooh, I wanted to hit him. I wanted to hit him. I saw it go all the way. Jalen, if you don't stop pissing me off, hit Topic. All the way? Go all the way? You're bigger than him? Thank you, Topic. Y'all are so lucky. Jalen Johnson fucked that up so much. If you don't just use the fact that you're like 6'9 and athletic, and I've worked with Jalen Johnson in person, I know he would dunk that basketball. I'm here. That's a good closeout by me. He still wet it in my mouth. That's insane. Oh my god, they're not missing. But, you know, that's that's like I said, that's how it is sometimes. And we, we don't know how to switch hands. Like, that's really annoying to me. We in the NBA and we don't know how to switch hands. That's that's a little infuriating to me. Don't, 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 don't. Why did you jump at the free throw line pull up like that? Y'all just, y'all disappoint me. Y'all disappoint me. Jalen Johnson should be able to attack Dario Saric, something stupid. Really? He just times everything perfectly? That's how it is, huh? He just times everything perfectly? Give me this basketball. Fuck you. <laughs> We don't know how to play defense. All right. I didn't realize we didn't work on that the whole offseason. So thanks for letting me know, y'all. Really appreciate it. Topic has been getting to the hoop great. That's awesome. He's our best player, so I expect that. But, man, <laughs> let's let's get Sar back in, man. We got, we got one last chance to make this thing happen before I trade the whole damn team away. So we finally get to see these three together. Let's see what it looks like, man. Got to figure it out right now. Got to figure it out right now. Got to play some defense. Do I just put Herb on like these dudes do i have like no dylan harper's a good defender like this these are the things we got to test him with these are the things we got to test him with where are we going just don't don't let stefan castle just like dribble all over the floor on us like we can do this we're fine we're fine good stay on him harper stay on him good defense harper let's go give it up to harper one on three dylan harper all the way all the way foul thank you Let's get another one. We can still come out. Luca was over the line. I saw it. That's why I missed. Oh, y'all cheating me again. Y'all just let him cheat because he's that good, huh? I was going to say because he's white, but I don't want that guy leaving another mean comment on my video. That's a lie. I really do want him to leave another comment. That I told you it made my night. Let's go. Let's go. Give it up to Dylan. He's got one-on-one -on -one with Luca. All the way. That's a dunk or something. That's a good float. That works, too. Whatever you got to do to get two points, Dylan, I'm, I'm here for it. He's a star in the making. He's a star in the making. Um, we're going to sag off with Johnson, actually. They're trying to do... Nope. See? We got to hedge him. Hedge him. Hedge him. Hedge him. Hedge him. I'm here. I'm here to help. Give me that basketball. Oh, you guys make me so upset. You know what? It's fine. We're not title contenders this year anyway. We're building something, right? We're trying to build something. And build something we will, right? As I go to the rim here. So is Derek Lively just like the best basketball player on the planet? Like, is that what I'm gathering here? He blocks every shot that'll ever go up on the hoop. 
Like, he's just got, like, psychic powers to know exactly where I'm putting the ball at all times. Give me that. Don't... What? Oh. I wasn't familiar with your game, sir. Okay. You know what? Then this is what we're doing. This, this is what we're doing. Let's at least... Let's at least do this. Let's at least do this. Let's at least let Dylan Harper show off why he was... Why he's our guy. Right? We're going to spin around, go all the way, float it up. He's our guy. Dylan Harper's our guy. All right? Uh, I'm starting him ne I'm starting him next video. Y'all don't even have to leave the comment. Tell me why am I so... Here's, here's what you should comment. Tell me why I was dumb enough to not start Dylan Harper right away when I knew he was the best player on the team. Are they the best players to ever play basketball ever? Is that is that what I'm understanding? Go all the way. Pass that ball up. Good. Oh, I didn't think it actually passed it. Oh, all the way. Dylan Harper, all the way. Okay, fair enough. Oh, he got the rebound because he's the GOAT. Put it up, please. And one. No, whatever. Screw off. All right, end of the game. All righty. So didn't get a win in that one. That's okay. But don't click off this video yet. We're not done. I'm not done yet. I don't like how this ended. We're going to find... We're going to find a happy way to end this because I want this season to be happier than last season. So y'all just, just wait. Next game we got is against the Celtics. So we're going to simulate this with SimCast and we're going to watch and we're going to see how good we do. The Celtics are supposed to be the best team, right? So if this game's close, if we can stay close with these boys, I'll jump in. You know what? Right here, six points down, we're jumping in this game. We're getting in this game right now, and we're beating the best team in basketball. That's how we're going to finish off this video. Why is Sar and Akangwu in all the time together? What's what's happening? What's happening? Oh, put it up. Bucket? No. Damn it. <laughs> oh, Lord have mercy. We look kind of clean in them white unis, though. We look like a bunch of Atlanta angels. You know what I'm saying? But um, we're going to beat the best team right here, and we're going to be better. That's what's going to happen. Is that Billy Donovan? Is he coaching the Celtics now? How the hell did that happen? I thought he was going to go to Kentucky or something like that. I, I actually like Billy Donovan as the Bulls coach. Like, I just think they have a bad team, in all honesty. Like, a team that doesn't work well together. But let's see. Let's see Dylan Harper going at Jalen Brown. He's... Okay, I'll start him. I'll start him next game. I'm sorry. He earned it. I said that we'd make him earn it. He's earned it. All right? He's the best player we have. He's just, that's what he is. Jalen Hood Shafino taking that shot. Yes, please. And Dylan Harper's getting rebounds. Ooh, don't make me spin move on you. Don't make me spin move on you. I thought you was going to jump for sure. I thought you was going to jump for sure. Oh, I traveled. I traveled. Go all the way. Alex Saar. Alex Saar. Come on, we're coming back. Kevin Love, you ain't got nothing on me, man. You can wear Tony Allen's number all you want. You ain't playing no defense out here, my guy. Come on, y'all. They don't have a ton of scoring in right now. We got to lock in. We got to lock in. We got to get some stops. There we go. There we go. Run, Dylan. Run, Dylan. Run. All, or all the way, Bones. All the way, Bones. Can I get a foul there? Oh, no. Get it. Get it. Get it. Oh, why? Why did you tap it up like that? I, why would that be a thing that you want to do, Sar? Oh, that makes me so upset. Coach, take out the centers. We don't need both of them in right now. That's poor spacing. <laughs> like, we've got three, like, non-shooters in the game right now. That makes me so upset, and that's fine. Should For real, Shafino's like this now? Anybody that goes to the Celtics, man, I tell you, just becomes an absolute problem. All right, 10-20 pick and roll. Y'all already know. Y'all already know. That's a jam! Ugh! One-point game. Come on, y'all got to keep up now, boss. And now that I'm on the sticks, y'all thought you was walking away with this one. Not on the home court, man. I'm not starting out the season one and two. You start off the season one and two, your fans are already just not showing up to any more games. Especially in Atlanta. It's just not... Give me that. Top itch. Go. Go. Give it up to Dylan. All the way. Dylan Harper with the reverse! With the reverse jam, Dylan Harper! That's what I'm talking about. Thank you, sir. Thank you. That's what I needed to see out of you, my guy. Get me hyped. Get me hype. We'll, we'll take that, Jalen. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Give it up to Dylan. All the way, Dylan. I see you. I see a Kong Wu. He does everything for us. He's the assist. He's the shot. He's the finisher. He sells the tickets, man. He might as well scrub the bathrooms. He does everything for the team because he's the best player. Oh, that should be a steal. My dad used to have this saying for this guy that played on our team uh, growing up on our AAU team that basically all he did was get rebounds. He was just this lengthy white kid. Um, again, don't leave the comments on me, but, um, my dad called him Windex because he said he cleaned the glass so well. I'm like, that's fucking crazy that you call him. <laughs> I'm like, you gotta stop calling him Windex. But I also, 
kind of hilarious. So <laughs> I don't know. Well, y- y'all let me know what kind of nicknames like your coaches called you or whatever. Um, but that that nickname always cracked me up. Sar, why do you jump at them so hard? Come on, y'all. We should be able to attack Kevin Love here, and yes, we can. Alex Sar, 27 points, 9 rebounds. That's that's why he was Rookie of the Year, y'all. He's the best out there. He's the best player on the team, and he's the best out there in the league. It's just just how it is. There's It's nothing but facts I'm telling you right now. Um, why do y'all just mug him? Herb, did you... Re- I know I had a sub coming in for you, but, like, did you just want to come out that bad? Come on, AJ. Come on, AJ. All right, we're here. We're here. No, you left Clay Thompson open. Damn it, AJ. That's all right. It's a tie game. It's a tie game. And Jalen Hood Shafino is on me with Chris Stapps Porzingis, who also has lost his jersey number somehow. We're running this through here. We're trying to snake it so that we can get this pass off. Thank you. I tried to throw it higher, but he threw it through his body. Um, 2K shit. Don't worry about it. All right. <laughs> but we're good. We're all good here, y'all. We're all good. I can't help off of him, so I gotta help here. We're good here. Don't let Porzingis get inside position. That's why. Okay. All right. Is what it is. I feel like I'm watching college basketball when I see shit like that. Ooh, attack. Kevin Love can't keep up. Kevin Love can't keep up. That's in the green. Y'all saw it in the green. I, 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 I let it go perfectly, but 2K doesn't want me to succeed. They just, they just don't. I think they program this game directly to hurt me. I really think they do. They sit down and they go, oh, AVC's going to hate this shit so much. He's going to hate it so much when we do this to him. Ooh, he's going to hate it. He's going to be so mad. He's going to get on camera and look really fucking stupid in front of people. But, you know what? I'm just in a room by myself right now. I'm going crazy, I think. Come on. He can't guard me. He can't guard me. All the way. And one. I finished in the green. You guys saw it. I finished very late. Fuck off. It's about right. It's about time we got to make something happen. You know, I'm taking him all the way because he's little. Yeah, he's too little. He can't guard me. Topic, it's time for you to start getting your buckets, man. If they're going to play... um, Wait, who is this? Jose, Jose Calderon's, like, Mexican cousin? Is that who's on the court? Oh, my God, y'all. Guard people. What's happening on these screens, y'all? Y'all can't get around screens? Oh, attack. Attack. All the way, Jalen. Can I... Oh, we're lucky we timed that right because they didn't give me a bar. And I, I don't like them for it. I don't like them for it. Maybe I should just turn off the bar, too. Maybe that's fair. <laughs> maybe that's just what I need to do. Like, because obviously I don't have it on for shooting anymore. So maybe I should just take it off for layups, too, since it just flat out doesn't work most of the time. Um, don't let him cut down. Don't let him cut down. Don't let him cut down. Who is this Calderon? Give me that. Nope. Bad shot. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, CJ. Come on, CJ. Go get me a bucket before I sub your ass out. Go get me a bucket before I sub your ass out. You just can't do anything good for me, can you, CJ? I'm sorry I said that, CJ. I love you. I just... I'm just upset with you right now. And sometimes Daddy says things that he doesn't mean when he's upset. All right? I don't know what's going on with my psyche right now, but I'm clearly about to have a mental break. All right, y'all. Come on. Operation, play some defense. Operation, play some defense. No, that's not Operation, play some defense. They missed. Oh, my God, they're horrible at basketball. Dylan Harper is really, really good at basketball. Did y'all know that? Did y'all know Dylan Harper's really good at basketball and sees everything? Oh, it makes me happy. See, Ron Harper took some of those championship genes and gave them to Dylan. That's, That's the key right there. We've got championship pedigree in our locker room now. Let's go. Let's go. I know there's a good defender on you. I don't really care if I'm being completely honest. Give it to Sar. Kick it back out because I don't want to do something stupid here. Oh, attack. Attack, please. Attack, please. No, like the green bar's there. It's there. How can it be late if it never even hits the top? I don't. That doesn't make any sense from even like a programming standpoint. I don't, I don't understand that, 2K. Jalen's here. They've got so many good basketball players on the court. Oh, no, Dylan, help. Y'all got to help on that. Like, what are you guys watching? Do Y'all just got your hands in your pants? Time for you to get moving. I said, okay, my bad, my bad. I attack. I attack Jalen hood Shafino. I attack him. They steal the ball because the pass button was too late. That's a steal by me. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Dylan Harper. Dylan Harper. I see Jalen Johnson. They, why did he take it from me? I take it back from him because we're the best basketball team here. And one. Give me an and one, ref. <laughs> Damn. Like, look at him. He grazed my ass here. Oh, okay. Maybe he didn't. Maybe I just felt it. Maybe I wanted to feel it. All right. We're good. 
Give me this basketball. I want this basketball so bad. Don't, you guys gotta guard him. Yo, what are you doing, AJ? Oh my goodness gracious lord. Give me this, let's go. Dylan, with Sar. Run, Sar. Run, Sar. All the way, all the way. Finish, and one, and one, Dylan Harper. Come on, man. Yeah, pat, pat him on his head. He did a good ass job. Quinn is baffled. <laughs> Quinn was absolutely baffled there. Uh, y'all give me a like, man. I, I'm recording way too long for this shit. I got other things to do today. I gotta pack. I gotta do laundry. I gotta get ready for flights and stuff. Just somebody, somebody just show a little love. Especially because I'm not sure we're gonna win this game. But we're gonna win this game. We got this. All right, we got this. We're switching everything. We're ready to go. I see Jason Tatum coming. He's taking a bet. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna have to give out spankings at the end of this game. I think this is the only that's just the only logical way I can think of how to deal with this. Like what what other appropriate punishment would there be for this type of defense? Right? Like come on. Like you guys tell me, what else should I do? Corporal punishment is all I can think of. Alright, we gotta go. We gotta go. I really don't want Johnson like in the pick and roll like this, but it's what we gotta do. Let's go up. Let's get a jam. Thank you. Alright. Dylan Harper, we're running everything three. He's got 23 and eight right now. Um, this is good. We've at least found ourselves our star player, <laughs> right? Take a bad shot, why don't you? White men are jumping over me at every single turn. Why? <laughs> attack, 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 attack. <gasps> I tried, he hurt me, ref. He hurt me. Like, he hit me. I saw. Oh, did somebody guard them. No, 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 no. No, no. I wanted this video to end happy. I'm so sad. I'm so sad. Attack all the way. Thank you, Dylan. Thank you, Dylan. Good pass by Top Itch. That's what I'm talking about. Let me see this jam real quick. Ah! All right. We got something to look forward to this year. It's Dylan Harper. Everybody else on the team, upset with you. Upset with all of you. I couldn't be mad at Sar or Top Itch. I really couldn't. I couldn't be mad at a lot of these guys. I love these guys, but no. Oh, uh, I'm sad. I'm sad. Go, Sar. Go do your thing, Sar. All the way, please. All the way. Like, don't fall over afterwards. You're a big, strong athlete. Like, I just expect better out of you. All right. Well, you know what? This game's gonna be what it's gonna be. We're just never gonna get around a fucking screen again because Jalen Johnson doesn't know how to do it. Is Jalen Johnson on the trade block, y'all? He might just have to be. Let's go here. Give me that. Put it back up, please. What? What? What just happened? Y'all just, like, chopped him down like a tree? Attack. All right. On Jason Tatum. On Jason Tatum. Good. Cut to the end of the video. Okay, so we lost. Um... We've got some holes we need to fill, still. Um, you know what, just to make me happy, let's just simulate through a couple more days. See, there's a dub. Give me another dub here for our playing game. Give me a... We lost to Washington? Who do... No, we didn't lose to this team with Woody Popson. Who the fuck is Woody Popson? And Omer Yurtsevin? What happened in this game? What happened in this game? Woody Popson happened in this game. He didn't fucking miss. All right, Woody Popson, we're trading for Woody Popson. Why? Woody Popson's a goon. How is he a 74 overall? What is he bad at? Explain to me what Woody Popson is bad at right here. He can drive. He can shoot. Hold up really quick. Who's my backup shooting guard? It's about to be CJ McCollum, but CJ McCollum might be off the team for Woody Popson in a goddamn second. What's his vertical at? All right, it's not anything crazy, but what's his hustle? Hustle ain't crazy. He got no intangibles. That's Woody Popson's thing. He got no intangibles, but he don't fucking miss. We lost to him in Edmund Summer. Sumner? No, no. Something got to change, y'all. Something got to change, and y'all y'all need to let me know what it is. Leave me a comment. Do something like that. Hit the subscribe button. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.